Yo, what's going on, everyone? So on my Twitter and on my YouTube uh, community tab, I asked you guys for questions for my 50,000 subscriber special, which is going to be a QA. and a uh, So above me is the first question. And uh, yeah, let's just get right into it, answering the questions. So first question is, did you ever think you would get to 50,000 subscribers? And uh, if you were to go back two years from now, uh, if you were to go back two years ago, uh, I definitely did not think I would ever reach 50,000 subscribers. Uh, because I was mainly thinking I was going to be a Twitch streamer and I was going to do YouTube maybe on the side. Uh, I watched some. I watched a guy named Harris Heller told me that YouTube was a great way to grow your Twitch stream. And, you know, I started doing YouTube like literally like two months before I got banned on Twitch. I started posting YouTube videos like every week or every two weeks I'd post like one video. And I really didn't think I would grow that fast on YouTube. And, uh, yeah, I, I didn't think I was going to reach 50K until uh, that Tanker video blew up and then Tanker came in and and snuck into my tournament, made a video about the tournament, and that's when I knew maybe I had a chance at someday hitting 50k, 100k, maybe even more than that. Uh, so yeah, that's the answer to the first question, Toon. Thank you for asking that question. Krista Cream, next question from Twitter, asks, do you believe the Arsenal election was rigged? 100% rigged. Uh, yeah, it was It was just rigged for uh, bandites. In the No, it wasn't rigged, dude. I mean, maybe a little bit, but like they all made a video about it. Uh, G, um, what's his name? John Roblox, um, Chase Rooney, and Bandites all made a video about it. Whoever wanted to go vote could have gone and voted. And uh, yeah, I even could have made a video about it if I really wanted to, but I wasn't really part of it. So, uh, the next question is by Bandites on Twitter. Ask, do you hold a special place in your heart for me, Bandites? Yes, I always will hold a special place in my heart for you. Just write. You guys, right there, right in my, where's your, I don't even know where my heart is really, but somewhere there, that, that's where it is. Uh, next question was by JJ, new P71. Will you ever let, all right, we're just going to skip over that question. Uh, what were you doing when you didn't do YouTube? Uh, what was I doing when I didn't do YouTube? Uh, well, before I was doing YouTube, I was doing Twitch, but if you're going back before I even started my Twitch stream, I worked at Jack in the Box. Uh, as you got, you probably, probably all know Jack in the Box, just like kind of like McDonald's where it's just a fast food restaurant. And that made me realize I did not want to work uh, a normal job where they determine your hours and such. And that's why I wanted to work either Twitch where I can determine my hours or YouTube. And now we're at YouTube because I got banned on Twitch. Twitch, please unban me, please, if you're watching this Twitch. Uh, next question is by Jenny. How did you meet Bella? Uh, I met Bella through, well, I, I knew about Bella, like, throughout high school. I had known who she was, but I didn't meet her, meet her until uh, Robotics Club. If you don't know what robotics is, it's where you build robots and then compete against other schools and such in, in, for our challenges. And, yeah, that, that is when we first met and actually got to know each other. Uh, next is by Stick RB. When is your birthday? April 19th is my birthday, 2001. I'm 19 years old. Uh, I, it's not trash as do you like one v one people more one v one people more than playing on public servers on Arsenal? Uh, it depends. You know, sometimes I like playing public servers, but usually I, I do like one v one as it's, it's just all around easier for me to one v one people than having to deal with a bunch of people trying to knife me and stuff. So, yeah. And do you think Chase Rooney is better than you at Arsenal? Yes, Chase Rooney is one of the best players I've ever seen play Arsenal. He's he's just cracked all around. I mean, he's got like the monkey powers and such. I mean, he's he's just insane. Uh, next question is, is it true? Oh, wow. Is it true that you have a crush on Chase Rooney by candy pizza eating doom guy? Um, I'm not going to confirm or deny these allegations, but, um, yeah, we're just going to leave it at that. Uh, newbie asked why you, why do I stream on Twitch anymore? Well, it's because I got banned because Raiden, uh, chat botted, follow botted and view botted me and chat botted other streamers saying, Hey, this is Jimbo slice. And yeah, I have a video about that on my main channel. If you guys want to check that out, showing what the reason why I think I got banned and uh, yeah, Twitch just never responded to any of my unbanned emails. So that's awesome. Uh, oh, walks clips and highlights asks, are you actual, actual colorblind? Yes, I am colorblind. I'm protein up colorblind. I've taken colorblind tests on stream and uh, yeah, shown that I am a strong protein up colorblind. Uh, Aaron asked what inspired you to do Arsenal content? PS thoughts on about playing on controller. Like what is it like playing controller in Arsenal? Your opinion? Controller's a lot easier than mobile, I'll say that. And what inspired me to do Arsenal content was literally Tanker coming into my... Well, see, the thing is, I was like a variety streamer on Twitch, and then Tanker came into my stream whenever I was just playing Arsenal at the time. Like, I wasn't a full-time Arsenal Twitch streamer. So Tanker came in, and then we play, and then we 1v1, and I was like, you know what? I actually kind of want to get good at this game to prove that I can maybe beat this guy. And that's when, uh, yeah, I started getting better at the game. 
Uh, next is David Greninja. Do you live with your parents? Yes, I do. And I don't know what the rest of that sentence is. Uh, who inspired you to do YouTube? So I've wanted to do YouTube since I was like a little kid, man. Like when I was like 10 or 11, I started posting YouTube videos. Like I might even make a video reacting to like my oldest YouTube videos on my first YouTube channel one day. If you want that, comment it down below that you want me to react to my old, old YouTube videos. I'll bring them up and uh, I'll show you guys <laughs> the cringe of my old, like 12 year old self playing Minecraft. Uh, but yeah, I watched Casey Neistat. I watched a ton of other big YouTubers that, that were big at the time, like PewDiePie and such. And, uh, yeah, I just really wanted to make videos like them and, uh, be inspirational. Uh, how old am I? I'm 19. And how did I discover Arsenal? Well, I mean, it was just a really popular game on Roblox. And when I, and I used to play Roblox in 2019, that's when I first started playing Roblox on stream. And, uh, yeah, it was just a popular game. People wanted me to play it. Uh, next after that is me and 19 amazing other SpaghettiOs. Ooh, okay. Do you like to eat donuts? Yes, I do like to eat donuts. That, that's a great question. Thank you for asking that. Uh, what's your favorite color? If I had to choose one favorite color, I think it would be blue. Like, I just like light blue and regular blue. I mean, the blue is just all around, I think, good color. Uh, next is Henrock asking, who is your favorite Arsenal YouTuber slash Twitch streamer? Well, I don't watch Twitch anymore as I am banned. I'm not allowed to watch Twitch. But my favorite Arsenal YouTuber, uh, I really don't have a favorite favorite. Uh, but I do like watching Chase Rooney, uh, Bandites, and Wake doesn't really post videos anymore. Uh, I like watching Tanger's videos sometimes. I mean, it's it, it it's a balance in between all those guys. Uh, do you have a girlfriend? Yes, Bella, as I talked about earlier. Met her in robotics, and uh, we've been dating for over two years, I'm pretty sure now. So, uh, Do you think you can get 100,000 plus subs? I think you can. Well, thank you for believing in me, man. I think at this point, I think it is possible for me in the future to get 100,000 subs. Don't know how long it's going to take, but uh, maybe drop a sub on my, my main channel if you haven't already. Uh, how did, oh, end 1907YT asked, how did you get good at Arsenal so quickly? Also, what YouTubers do you watch? Well, I already answered that. How did I get good at Arsenal so quickly? So basically, I've been playing FPS games all my life. Uh, been playing CSGO, been playing CSGO. I don't really know what other FPS games. I mean, I played Minecraft, which anything really helps you improve your aim. I just have really good aim in general, just like average good aim in, in general using a mouse, so... Uh, yeah, that's basically how I just got good. And then I just have like, uh, I just have, I, I use strategies a lot in order to get good at games. So I just developed good strategies, learned from other players and just uh, imitated those strategies. And that's how I got good at Arsenal. I have a ton of videos on my main channel explaining how to get good. Evie asked, how tall are you? I am 5'10". 5'10", maybe a little bit higher than 5'10", but 5'10", 5'11", maybe max. Uh, Lordox, what inspired you to start uploading? Well, like I said before, uh, what inspired me to start uploading on this channel was because of a guy named Harris Heller. He said making YouTube videos and Twitch streaming is is the best way for you to grow your channel. Like YouTube is very, uh, very like like good for getting your channel found. Uh, YouTube has a very better, way better algorithm for getting your channel found. And Twitch streams are obviously, you know, just Twitch streams. I mean. If you are not, not at the top of the of the list, which I actually was on Roblox, I was at the top of the list, so I was actually getting a lot of viewers. Uh, but if you're not at the top top of the list, then you won't really get found by many people. But that's what inspired me to start uploading. Uh, where did you get the name Jimbo Slice from? So back like four or five years ago, there was this guy named Tony, and I I, I used to go by the name like Jimbo sometimes. And then there's this guy named Kimbo Slice that was like a MMA fighter, I'm pretty sure, and. Uh, Tony was like, hey, you should maybe go by Jimbo Slice. And then I went by Jimbo Slice, J-I-M-B-O Slice. And then from there, uh, I decided I need a name that's not like the rest. Like, there's already Jimbo Slices. I need a name that's not like the rest. So I, I chose Jimbo Slice the way I spell it now because it's just a different way of spelling it, and it's the same thing. So thank you for asking that question, Sai. Shadowed Hollow asks, how was your first time live streaming on Twitch? First time live streaming on Twitch, I got so many viewers because I think a lot of people were coming from uh, from my Twitch Streams that didn't, uh, that were confused on why I was banned. Everybody wanted to know. Everybody wanted to know what the first YouTube stream is going to be like. And it was just a lot of hype around it. And yeah, I got a lot of viewers, a lot of views on that video and uh, on that stream. And it, it was a very fun time. I think Fusion Boys actually came into one of my first YouTube streams. Fusion Boys came into 1v1 me. Uh, Nick um, asked a lot of questions. Uh, is Bandites or Chase stinky? Uh, maybe. Uh, did you see my, f okay, what is that? Is Bob Ross a cool dude? Yes. What is, why is the sky blue? Um, because it felt like it. How are farts made? They're built different. Did you skip my questions? No. Did you notice I skipped the question? One, one, two, three, four, five, six. You now I did. Did you notice this question? Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag. We're very good questions. Thank you so much for that. 
Uh, Dorothy Wilson's Dead Goldfish. Wow, what a great name and has Wake Pro picture. What is your opinion on mobile gamers? Mobile gamers will never be as good as PC gamers, but, you know, because there's always going to be a skill cap where you get hit on mobile, and there's always going to be, like, PC skill cap up here, mobile skill cap down here. So the best mobile players will never be able to beat the PSP-based PC players just because of the amount of buttons we have. I mean, they're not able to scope on certain weapons. We just have so many more keybinds that we can use to do more stuff and be uh, more precise with our gameplay, and they really only have their, their little thumb, so... I mean, but they do great for the the best players do great for what what they uh what they have, and I uh, I think that's that's pretty good. Uh, Vex, do you like monkeys? Yes, monkeys are our life. Monkeys are amazing. How could you not like monkeys? Uh, what do you do when you're not playing Roblox? Well, I usually play chess, League of Legends, or Rocket League, or be, I'm editing videos, uh, or doing stuff with the tags, titles, descriptions, thinking of thumbnails, thinking of video ideas, you know, all the type of YouTube stuff that you got to be doing. That is usually what I'm doing. Uh, Bella, wow, asked a great question. Uh, why do you eat pancakes like that? And when she asked that, it's because I pour the syrup on and then I use my fork to make holes in the pancakes so that the syrup gets in to the pancake and then you eat it. And the syrup's like infused with the... You you guys get what I'm saying. You, It's the best way to eat pancakes if you don't already do that. Uh, do you take showers? Uh, contrary to popular belief, I actually do take showers. Usually either... Uh, once a day or once every other day, okay? I take showers. Yes, showering is good for your health. Thank, thank you for asking that question, V. Uh, Jenny asked again, do you play any sports? I used to play sports. I used to play football all throughout middle school, and I used to play soccer, I think, all throughout elementary school and before that. And uh, I, I think I played baseball one year, but uh, not, not, not really at all. But those are the sports I used to play when I was younger. Uh, Carrot asked, seriously, though, why should I subscribe to you? Please. This is the best reason I can give you. Baba Booey. Baba Booey. That is the best reason I can give you. Oh, actually, I got another one. Like and subscribe right now or all your Robux will disappear. I don't think you want your Robux to disappear. I in my case. Tanker asks, will you ever want... Oh, well, Tanker... Okay, okay. Will you ever 1v1 Tanker again? I asked him in DMs if he wanted a 1v1, and he never got back to me. So, I don't know. Maybe one day he'll, he'll want a 1v1 me. Maybe one day he'll come into my stream and 1v1 me. I don't know. Hopefully, hopefully in the future, I will want me one of them again, though. Furret Loaf, one of my mods, probably going to be a great question covering Furret Loaf. Uh, how many teeth do you have? Furret Loaf. I don't, I, the normal amount, I don't know. I just got my wisdom teeth removed, so that, I have the normal amount, that's not the wisdom. <sighs> Furret Loaf, why? Uh, SlideGD asks, do you miss Twitch, excluding the stupid reason you got banned? Well, I don't know. Twitch has been kind of crazy lately. Uh, they got PogChamp removed. They have been getting DMCA strikes out the wazoo. So I really don't know if I miss Twitch. I mean, I kind of already love streaming on YouTube. And uh, yeah, uh, coming to my YouTube stream, streaming every other day. You already know. You already know. Uh, next question is, have any particular YouTuber inspired you to start YouTube? Yeah, like I said before, Harris Heller was the main reason that I started this YouTube channel. Or my, my main YouTube channel. Um, but... Another person that inspired me, obviously, I said Casey Neistat, PewDiePie, uh, a bunch of big YouTubers. There's just a lot of YouTubers on the platform that inspire me. And also Ludwig. Ludwig is my favorite YouTuber, and uh, he inspires me to make better content every, each and every single day. Uh, the OG Magma said, who are you? I'm Jimbo Slice. Thanks for asking that question. Uh, cool Dorito 77 asked, why do you hack? Uh, because I feel like it. That's why. Uh, <laughs> wow, this amazing questions. We at Roblox asked, why do you 1v1? Well, I 1v1. Oh, well, I guess it's actually kind of a deeper question. It, why do I 1v1? It's because uh, Raiden, uh, the guy that hacked, that, that got my uh, Twitch stream banned, uh, Raiden actually hacks every single game. If I play a public server on, on, on stream, he'll just come in and hack the server and, and ruin it. So that is the reason I only usually do 1v1s is because of Raiden. Uh, next question is by Stick Roblox. Do you work out? And barely. I mean, I, I, I sometimes go on runs with my brother in the morning, and I sometimes do pull-ups. I got a pull-up bar here and my brother uses mainly, but, uh, yeah, not, not, not really, but, uh, I sometimes do. And I think that is the last question. Uh, so yeah, if you have any more questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments below. Maybe I'll answer you with a comment. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, like and subscribe to my main channel and this channel, my second channel, you already know. And, uh, yeah, hope to see you guys soon. Hope to see you guys later. Uh, uh, this is not. Peace out.